It's not easy for everyone to fly so low at a holiday party, especially if you're not going to know too many people there. But there are some the really simple tricks to help you come out of your shell a bit and, and feel more confident anyway. Yeah, Kim Ritberg is an on-camera media coach. She's joining us now to help us all shine at those holiday parties. Thank you for joining us. Thank you so much for being here. All right, so Kim, what do you recommend to be confident at a holiday party, especially if you're by yourself? So a lot of these tips are the same ones as for public speaking or being on camera. The most important thing is to do some mental preparation. We tell ourselves a lot of stories. Number one, don't forget, a lot of people feel uncomfortable. You are not alone. Number two, there's no spotlight on you. So when you're walking around the party, there's no hawk and you're the prey and they're watching you. It's just a party. So untell those stories to yourself. Prepare some conversation topics. Preparation really does help take that pressure off. Uh, wear something you love. So mm -hmm. whether that's red lipstick or a silly tie, I personally like to wear a big, bold piece of jewelry because not only does it make me feel comfortable, but it's always a conversation oh, starter. Okay. Um, and then breathing techniques. You need to be able to manage your body. We go into fight or flight mode. And so if you practice those breathing techniques, you're able to balance out your body mm -hmm. and calm yourself down. And speaking of balancing your energy, you're then gonna wanna raise your energy a little bit. So I recommend listening to some music that you love, whether that's Lizzo or Ariana Grande <laughs> or the Rolling Stones, whatever gets you in a good mood. So when they're dancing with some big jewelry on mm -hmm. and you're gonna, have, you know, all right. So why do some of us get uncomfortable in social situations like these? Like I, I'm one that I'm fine at work, but if I get to a party like that, I, I feel like, oh gosh, I don't, I, I'm not one that's gonna go up to a group of three people and introduce myself ever. Absolutely. A lot of us tell these stories to ourselves in our head. It's going to be awkward. I'm not going to know anybody. Yeah. And really, you have to look at the past. You've gone to other parties. You've talked to people. People talk to you. And it's really never as bad as we make it out to in our yeah. mind. And it's the same with being on TV. When people are on TV, you press that record button and people freeze up and feel like a robot. It's because of the stories we tell ourselves. And the more prepared you are, the better you'll be, both preparing for the party and then knowing how to get your body ready. We actually had someone on a segment that says she actually recommends that you go to these events by yourself because then you're forced to meet new people and not just shelter with yeah. the person that you came with. So what about some tips when you're actually at the party? What can you do to kind of calm yourself down? Absolutely. The biggest tip I can give is to smile. Smile is amazing for so many reasons. Number one, it makes you feel better. It actually sends out neurotransmitters to make you feel happier. It also creates a connection between you and the person you're talking to. But lastly, warming, warming, smiling warms up your voice and people can hear that warmth in your voice and then they wanna talk to you more. So you're going in, you're smiling. Don't forget to have really open body language. If you see someone in the corner of a room and their arms are crossed, you're not gonna talk to them, right? So you shouldn't, don't be that person. <laughs> and then uh, don't be that person. As you get into the conversation, make sure to make eye contact. You're really trying to build that connection with those people. And one of the tips that I have, and this is not the same as for public speaking or being on camera, you could take a break. If you're feeling overwhelmed, sneak off to the bathroom, regroup, and tell yourself, good job. Because if you were nervous to come to this party, you're there, you're doing it, and you're winning everyone over. I thought you were going to say have a glass of wine and see it right. on the list. But don't but drink too much. I know, but not too much. Uh, Kim, nice to see you. Thanks so much for joining us this afternoon and sharing your tips. Thanks so much. Happy holidays. Yo, you too. Well, to see more of Kim's advice, you can visit her website, kimritberg.com. You can also follow her on Instagram at Kim Ritberg.